everybody! Minx from Minx Den Part 2 here. Um, today I'm doing another Itsy review. It's just one review this time, so it's number seven. And the shop on Itsy that I'm reviewing today is Duty Bear. Um, about a week ago, I think, is when I ordered this necklace. And um, I actually ordered some deco tape with this order. But um, what I'm reviewing today is the necklace because it's a personal purchase. Um, and this is it right here. This is my green Hanari Tofu Kawaii Plush Necklace. It's squishy. It's really soft. And yes, it has a bell. And of course, my cats just absolutely love it. One of them's down there just watching me like a hawk. <laughs> but I don't let my cats play with it or anything. But um, anyway, yeah, I love this necklace. I've been wearing it almost every day since I got it in the mail. And um, I have ordered from Duty Bear, I think at least, oh well, a dozen times? I don't know. Uh, maybe more. But, um, yeah, I've never been dissatisfied by anything, anything she did in every visit that I've made to her. And um, I mostly order business-related purchases. And just real quick, her shop is very, you know diverse in the items that she offers. I'll just click on her shop real quick. And um, like these necklaces, there were other colors to choose from. It was a really, really tough decision because I liked all four colors. And um, I don't generally have a favorite color anyway, but I just love the green guy. He's just so cute. Um, there's pink, yellow, blue, and then the green one, which I purchased. And there are other plush necklaces similar to this. It was a milk carton plush necklace. And well, I believe the colors are brown, red, pink, green, and blue. I really want to get one of the um, plush, ne uh, I think they're the milk carton ones, plush milk carton necklaces. I'm leaning more towards the red or pink. I haven't decided yet. So um, we'll see. I'm, I'm just, I'm very indecisive. It took me literally two hours to decide which one of these I really, really wanted. But um, the price on these aren't that bad, actually. Um, let me just check my invoice again real quick. See what I paid. I had to be accurate on my numbers here. Okay. There we go. Okay. So for this necklace, the base price that I spent was $7. It's not bad at all. I think my price range on any necklace that I get on Etsy is like low, lower than $25. I generally don't like spending more than $25, unless it's like a really nice necklace, but um, like really like like precious stones are involved, like, I don't know, and like metals and stuff. But like cute little, you know, like novelty store necklace type stuff like these, you know, I, I this is very good, this is very reasonable, I would think. And uh, the shipping on this was $2, but the whole order on that order with the deco tape, I only spent $12 altogether. Uh, so everything's really inexpensive, really good prices. Um, I'll go back to her shop I'll tell you just generally what she sells. She sells like best BFF necklace sets. She makes her own polymer charms. I believe she does. If you don't, please correct me. Um, or at least comment below. And um, she does like these little... Um, Mini card stationery sets. I've bought those in the past. Of course, deco tape sets. I've bought those. She does like cell phone charms, necklaces, earrings, little squishy charms, like cake slices, donuts. I'm just looking through her shop. She sells stickers too. I've bought stickers from her in the past, at least a couple times. Uh, she has little tiny mini plushies from the looks of it. Yeah, there's there's a lot of cute stuff. And I'm looking at those tofu ones already and the milk carton ones. Yeah, and like I said, she has quite a few items in her shop. Like, I think it's like, you know, it's in the hundreds. So there's lots and lots of variety to choose from. So, yeah, I'm just... And she has these cute Hello Kitty type necklaces on ball chains. I mean, and she has like sale items too, if you're looking for a good bargain. So, anyway, yeah, that's pretty much the gist of it. And these are, like, the memo sheets. She does custom orders, if, just as long as you ask. She's really good on her communication. I usually order a hundred of these little mini ones at a time. You know, I get, like, all these. And she does lots of different varieties, which I really like. You know, um, it, just as long as you ask her, and within reason, she, I'm sure she'd had no problem 
uh, fulfilling your requests. But, um, and yeah, I don't think I've ever waited longer than five days in getting her stuff in the mail. She's very quick about shipping, and you can, you're able to track your own packages, which is nice. So anyway, um, I, and I do my grading scale, A, B, C, D, F, just like, a, like at school. And I don't do A minus, B minus, or A plus, B plus. I just give straight A, B, C, D, F. And my grade for Duty Bear is an A! Congratulations, Duty Bear, on 100% review. I'm 100% satisfied and 100% happy. And you know I'll be back on return visits many more times in the future. Not just for business-related purchases, but personal as well. And all your items just speak to me. I only buy what speaks to me what truly grabs, literally almost grabs me out of my laptop. So, um, yeah. So I hope you all enjoyed this another uh, Itsy review. And you can, oh yeah, you can click her link down below. This is for the link to her Itsy shop, and it'll take you directly to her shop. You can see all the cute items for yourself. If you have any questions about anything, uh, about this or any other items I've purchased, please do ask me in the comment section. Uh, no mean comments, please, by the way. No rude comments either, peoples. This is a positive place of business and fun and pleasure. So, anyway, thanks again, Duty Bear. I'm very happy. Okay, bye!